It's been two and a half years of the Trump presidency in the United States is in a much different place than it was in 2016. So how do Trump voters feel about their choice now? Randy Kay speaks with two work colleagues who have surprising answers. Wisconsin voter Dave Savarovich voted for Trump in 2016, but now he regrets it. What are you thinking for 2020? You plan to support Donald Trump again? Absolutely not. Why not? Because I don't want to have another four years of embarrassment going on. And what we've seen this past week, he says, is just another example of that. That tweet that everybody's talking about, I would not define that as a racist tweet, but it is a hatred tweet for sure. His co-worker at this Eau Claire, Wisconsin plumbing company, Carrie Krumenauer, also voted for Trump in 2016, and she sees it differently. How is it racist? If you don't like this country, get out, leave. That's all he said. He didn't use any names. They stood up, <laughs> so that's all they did. They made themselves look like idiots. Unlike her co-worker, Dave, Kerry has no regrets about voting for Trump. He takes no crap from anybody, and that's why I love him. He has followed through on promises that, he's kept, that he made to the American people. Like what? Give me one. Texas. Uh, he's working on the border. We're back in charge again. We're not taking guff. I mean, he is, he is working with North Korea like no other president ever has in the world before. Unlike Kerry, Dave really regrets his vote. I didn't know he was going to act this way, um, so I am, I'm embarrassed by him. What don't you like about the president? He doesn't act that, like a president should in my eyes. He, in a way, I think, spreads hatred. It's like a little kid having a temper tantrum, the way he talks about blah, 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 or whatever, however he says it, you know, it comes across. It, to me, is childish. He says Trump should stop taking credit for things like the economy. You don't think he's been good for business? I can't say it's his, uh, he alone is the reason why everything's booming at this time. I, it didn't happen as soon as he took office. It was already starting to improve. Kerry sees it differently. I have thought this, com this country needs to be run like a business. Um, it was ran into the ground for eight years, and it's time to bring it back. And he's done it. Kerry also thinks Trump is right to build a wall and limit immigration. Dave argues this country needs immigrants. Dairy products would be so much more expensive. Um, vegetables that are grown around here or anywhere in the United States, everything would be much more expensive if it wasn't for the immigrants. But he ran on that pretty much when you voted for him in 2016, right? Once again, I thought he was a better option than Hillary. <laughs> so it wasn't necessarily a vote for Trump in 2016. No, it was it a vote wasn't. against Hillary Clinton. Exactly. Is there anything that Trump can do that would change your mind or you are dug in? No, I'm dug in. I'm behind him 100%. You're on the Trump train. I am on the Trump train. I'm in the front car with him pulling the whistle. 